Yo, you've tuned in to another episode, Just Jokes FM, sponsored by Comedy Time TV, and I'm your host today, DJ Silva. And today, we are going to be interviewing expert self-defense guru from Birmingham, living in Hounslow, Steve Marshall. But before we get there, let's take a look at what he can do. I think Paulie would probably be a bad <laughs> Tragedy! Oh, oh, tragedy! Oh, so here we are. Should we go? Oh, 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 now we got five questions from this time from you fans, exclusive to our show. Let's give them a call, shall we? Steve! Oh mate, how you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Nice, nice. I see you're out and you've got and you've got your, your friend there with you as well, is that right? Yes, my mate Paulie. Brilliant. Yeah. Lovely, lovely. Okay, uh, well, uh, we got some questions for you, so how about we uh, dive right in? Yeah, fantastic, just go over it, shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay, right, question one. And this is from Rickard from Luton. All right, Rickard, so, what made you want to teach self-defense in your local area? Uh, the reason I wanted to do martial arts in my local area, it's actually not my local area. I'm originally from Birmingham, yeah. but uh, I met Paul Lee online. And he kind of introduced me to Hounslow, didn't you? And uh, yeah, we want to just give back to the community because I believe in the day and age we live in, we need self-defense. Uh, Don't you agree? Weren't you beaten up that time? That mm, I was yeah. never beaten up. Yeah. Yeah, go far away. Sorry, there's a bit of a delay. Interesting answer. Uh, and your friend Paulie came out with something interesting there, but moving swiftly on. <laughs> Question two. And this one is from Deborah from uh, Reading. That's Deborah. Uh, what's the best way to stop someone from grabbing my booty? Hey, I'd like to know the answer to that one. Yeah, go for it. Uh, that's a clever one, but not a clever one. Just don't show it. Don't dangle the tuna. The dog won't bite. I mean, if you're flaunting it, you've got to expect it. If I've got my ass hanging out and I'm showing off my booty, you're going to get it grabbed. That's why I believe all women, mainly women with booties, all men with booties, need to learn martial arts. Uh, I hope that covers your question. Interesting. So there you have it, Deborah and ladies out there. If you've got a big booty, don't show it. And if it's too big to hide, go see my man Steve Marshall. He'll hook you up. Okay. Question number three, and this one is from Willie Smalls, <clears throat> Willie Smalls from Wales. <laughs> Willie Smalls. All right, Willie Smalls. Um, uh, who would win in a fight, you or Bruce Lee? Hmm. Oh, that's a good one. Me or Bruce Lee. It's funny you say that. He's the master. Exactly, <laughs> I'm the master, and that depends. Am I using the shitter? My own personal style versus his own personal style, the Jeet the, the, the Kune Do. The thing is, wh where are you putting me? Are we naked in the kitchen, man on man? You know? Or are we in a pub? Are we in a club? Where are we? You can't just throw that at me. But I think I would batter him. Or if it was nowadays, I'd just show him a picture of Brandon Lee and break his reaction speed. Yeah, show him a picture of his dead son. Did he just, did he just say that? Would you want roll? Uh, um, yeah, right. So, okay. Next question uh, from Shan Nice from Leeds. What's your favourite move to stop any attacker? Yeah. Ah, oh, that's a good one. What's my favourite move to stop an attacker? So, if he goes to punch me now, you might know this one. With your, with your, with your left. Go. Tragedy. See that tragedy? Steps into his face, into his balls. <laughs> Goodbye. No more. No more kids. What's the next one? Okay. <laughs> I wouldn't want to be that guy. All right. Last question, and this one is from 
Anonymous, all right, whoever you are, when are you going to start paying your child support to your ex-wife? Whoa, 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 whoa. No one talks about my kids on here. I'm here talking about martial arts in my career, not about my little bands. Who, who is that anonymous person? And I do pay money, actually, because I care for them and I get carer's allowance. So whoever's doing that is anonymous, a chicken shite. He doesn't want to face up to me. Uh, I pay my way. Oh, oh, I just got to stop you there quickly, Steve. I've got another question from the same person. Um... Can you please stop following your ex-wife when she takes the kids to school? And can you stop watching the kids when they play in the back garden? And ha ha, how does it feel to know your ex-wife has another lover who's bigger and better than you? Right, all right, right I've had enough. This interview is absolutely this uh, is terrible. Well, look no, at me, don't uh, make okay, the questions. You're sending them over. You want me to turn it off? No, no, no. He's going to go off one again. I'm going to tell him a little message. Steve, can you right. calm down, mate? Listen, I gave you my time. Steve, can you even hear me? Please. Okay. Steve, just, just, go off just look at the screen. Am Steve, yeah, 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 Steve, yeah, yeah. we are live. Yeah, you're, you're Steve! Yeah, I'm pissed off. Steve! Right? I'm not scared of you, okay? I'm a martial artist and I've got respect, okay? So whoever's this anonymous caller can... Oh, sorry about that, Steve. Looks like we ran out of time again. Everyone, you've been fantastic. You've been listening to DJ Silver, Just Jokes FM, sponsored by Comedy Time TV. Tune in next time and we'll have another interview just for you.